the smoke screen listed race for mares this time this is a two and a half mile hurdle and the top one is bear necessities for ryan tamasebi blossom tree for jim marie you can see they both won last week elevation leon van rensburg fountain springs for darren thompson grinder for craig beck with house of the wolf joshua sutherland international rescue paul Rhodes, karma rouge island alex cherry and popular class d hooley and Raphaela marlette for craig allen won last week as well ruby affair for willie mullins and waiting on you for martin ludham so quite a few unbeaten records on the line here called in and away then and racing towards the first of the flight so it should be about 10 to 12 of them i would have thought or we'll look at a minute or 14 that's a lot of a lot of flights to be jumped in a two and a half mile hurdle then and they get to the first of them and they are all safely over it although ruby affair is already a couple of lengths detached at the back elevation just about poking its head into the lead and they get over flight number two and House of the Wolf has now gone on. So House of the Wolf then for Joshua Sutherland, who took the opener today. It's over flight number three. They're all safely over that one. All mares these, of course. And it's House of the Wolf that leads by about two to three. To Fountain Springs in elevation. Over flight number four they go. And we have fair still with us at the back. The rest of them just sorted themselves out into the position they want to be in. House of the Wolf seems to be quite happy in the lead. And leads by three lengths to Grinder is moved through into second. Elevation is third, Fountain Springs is fourth. You can see Grinder and Fountain Springs in the same colours. Bare Necessities is in between them and the green of Paul Rose with International Rescue. One that's on the right on the inside in the maroon with the yellow cap is waiting on you. Raphael Milet is also tucked away on the near side actually that one. And the popular class is just at the back of the main group. Ruby Affair is carrying on at the back on her own as they get over number five. And House of the Wolf is clear in the lead. Seems to be happy enough to be on her own out in, out in front. Coming over to flight number six, which they're all over second. Good, good quick jump in second by Fountain Springs. Grinder and International Rescue are next. Then Bear Necessities and Elevation as they come to flight seven and the mistake again there by the Leon van Rensburg as that's every race so far the Leon van Rensburg horse has made a mistake didn't stop the one in race two from winning but it's most uncharacteristic and House of the Wolf is in the lead perhaps they've not been very happy because they've not had far to go in their horse box today as we are in Welsh Wales as I like to call it and House of the Wolf is in the lead International Rescue second, Grinders third, Fountain Springs is four, waiting on you is getting a bit closer in five and it's come off the fence, it's going to try and come round the outside now, the purple jacketed popular class is also pretty near to the leading group of the main group and House of the Wolf continues to make her own way home, four lengths clear, now, coming down to the next flight, they've only got a mile left to race now and House of the Wolf is in the lead. International Rescue and Grinder as they take number eight. We might get to see Ruby Affair jump this one if we're lucky. There she goes. Uh, right, nicely around in her own time. House of the Wolf then comes to flight number nine. Gets over it in the lead. Only leading by about two and a bit now. And Fountain Springs and Grinder together. They might well be both from the Craig Beckwith stable. Although Darren Thompson does sometimes slip on in with those colours. But House of the Wolf is in the lead. Grinder is second. Popular class is coming up on the inside and waiting on you is coming up around the outside. Then comes Elevation, Blossom Tree. There's plenty of chances, but they've got to get to this House of the Wolf who's still in the lead and has not been headed since taking the lead up inside the first furlong. So it's House of the Wolf in the lead. Grinder second, waiting on you third. Then Popular class, Elevation, and um, Popular. Uh, Fountain Springs after that one. Raphael Milet is going to try and get it around the outside. International Rescue and Bear Necessities just lost their place a little bit. The one that's trying to run on from the back is Come a Rouge Island, but it's Ru it's Ruby Affair, the one that's tailed off. But it's House of the Wolf in the lead then from Popular Class and Waited on You. They're beginning to bunch, but still in the lead by a length is House of the Wolf. House of the Wolf now about to be collared by Popular Class at the third last. Good jump there by Popular Class, who's gone on. Also being chased now by Raphael Milet. Waited on You, trying to run as well, but Popular. 
the class has hit the front. Popular class coming down towards the second last flight. Gets over it nicely. Gets away from it well. Being chased by Raffalo and Mayet. Then on the inside, House of the Wolf now looks beaten. They've got one more flight to take. And Popular class is in the lead. Popular class comes to the final flight. Gets over it nicely and gets away from it well and begins to quicken again. It's Popular class who's pulling away. And Popular class is going to take this one towards an unpopular class. Where is it? Raffalo and Mayet with second bear assist. It's House of the Wolf waiting on you. Elevation and grinder. International rescue barely got across the line and Ruby Affair is about a flight behind everybody else. We'll get round anyway and popular class takes it. That's David Hooley. It is indeed so popular class is the winner for David Hooley. Raphael and Lilette for Craig Allen was second. Bare necessities for Ryan Thomas said he was third. House of the Wolf for Joshua Sutherland, the long-time leader, stuck on for fourth and waiting on you was fifth.